Hi everyone, I hope you're all okay. So this is my nursery reveal video. I'm just standing outside the nursery now. and I'm about to go in and show you what we've done. I really hope you enjoy it. It's a really, really cute little nursery. Um, obviously we don't know what we're having, so it is gender neutral. And yeah, I'm just really looking forward to showing you because I feel like it's been a labor of love. Um, it's a tiny little room and I've gone through so many little ideas of what I want and I'm not sure and things like that but now that it's all come together I just feel really really proud of it and I'm really really I'm really happy with it Um, it's not 100% done there's still some things that need to be finished um, and some bits that we need which I'll run around when we go through it with you um, but yeah I really hope you like it I hope you take some inspiration from it if you are pregnant and you're doing a nursery yourself and yeah let's get started <laughs> Okay, so I've just turned the light off, um, up, sorry, to give you an actual good view of everything and talk you through it. So like I say, when I mean it's not done, I mean that's obviously not staying there, that's not staying there, and the blind is being changed. <laughs> so it's not 100% done, um, but I will show you through what we've done so far. So I will put a little video on the screen now, actually, of what it looked like before. This is what it looks like now. <laughs> I'm so happy with it. So I'm gonna go through where everything's from as well. So the cot and the changing table are from Tutti Bambini. Um, I just found them online. I just thought they were a really, really nice set. It's kind of, I can't remember what color they actually call it. I'll have a look, but it's kind of a bit of like a beigey green, I would say. Um, but it's really, really lovely color. Uh, and I really, really love it. So we've got them, and then obviously we've got the wardrobe here to match it, um, which is kind of, we're not really sure. We think it's been put up a little bit wrong, so we've got to kind of sort that out. But um, yeah, the wardrobe is there. And then, like I say, we've obviously got the changing table and the cot. So the changing table, I still need to get some sort of changing mat for it. Um, I just haven't really found one that I love, so I'm kind of waiting really to see, yeah, basically where we get something from. Um, this little shelf is from the little great trading company, I think it's called. I'll link everything down below. Um, but yeah, I just really loved it. I've seen it on quite a few people's nurseries, and I thought it was a really, really sweet little shelf. The little moon here is from b and I did actually put that on my stories the other day. And then obviously just got some little clothes here, which are just so, so sweet. I just absolutely love them. The bunting is from a little seller on Etsy. I will link it down below. Um, it was really, I honestly thought this was so reasonable. So I was looking for something neutral in here for such a long time and I couldn't find anything. And this on Etsy was 22 pounds, which they all thought was outrageously expensive. <laughs> I thought it was really, really cheap. Um, it's all handmade. And it's like a linen material. I don't know if my camera's going to focus. But yeah, it's really, really beautiful colours. Really lovely neutral. I think it goes so well over the panelling. It just gives it like a bit more of a fun feel rather than like too grown up. Really, really happy with the bunting. The canopy was actually very kindly gifted to me by Mimi Bear, which is a really beautiful children's shop. It's actually online, but their, their HQ is actually just down the road from me, which I thought was really interesting. Um, but yeah, it's absolutely beautiful. I've been looking for a canopy for such a long time. Um, and they, yeah, they basically said I could choose an item off their website to showcase in the nursery and this is what I chose and I just absolutely love it. Really, really easy to put up and they do have quite a few colors as well in this design, but they also have quite a few colors in different designs as well. Like I think there's more of a linen-y one 
um there's a few that come without the bubbles i like the bubbles i thought they're really playful but um yeah they do a few more but yeah it was really easy to put up i basically threaded the wire through here uh dale obviously screwed it to the ceiling and then i just actually gave it a little steam and i just think it's come out really really well i just think it adds like a really beautiful little luxurious feel to the nursery the cot mattress we actually end up getting from john lewis in the end and then the little bear where did we get oh somebody actually gave us that for christmas actually i think um and i thought it was a bit like milo and like i say these aren't staying in here but this is the snuzz pod which is going in our room oh baby's having a little wriggle and then this is the baby born bouncer which will be going downstairs um but i'm just keeping it up here just for now so when these are gone obviously this gap will be empty um and we don't really know what to put in here to be honest it's almost too small for a chair but i feel like we could probably do with a little chair so i'm not really sure what we're gonna do i think to be honest for the time being i might just get like a little stool and a few baskets or something and just pop them down there um we were going to move the cot in the middle but because of the radiator there and a window we felt like it was a little bit nicer that it was away from like, the you know the draft that a window brings and then also away from the heat that the radiator brings so yes that is where everything is from okay so first drawer i've tried to be as organized as i can but there is a few things that still need doing so this size we've got um size one nappies we've got size two here i really don't know what they're going to be going into so i just thought i'd have both there we've then got some wipes here we've got a few stashed stashes of wipes um i do really want to get a nice white box as well i remember my um sister-in-law had one of them and it looked really really nice with the wipes inside it and got loads and loads of muslins which are all been washed and ironed and they're all rolled up uh we then got nappy sacks and then also some cotton wool pads which i think we have to use for the first few days uh, and then this is just a big kind of like swaddly muslin cloth so yeah, that's the first drawer, everything we kind of need. Um, I need to still get some more bar barrier cream, I think it is, or like some sort of thing, because in here, I'll show you. This is our little nappy caddy for downstairs, where we've got, again, wipes and nappies. Um, but in here, I have actually got barrier cream in here. So I need to get another one for down here. Why is my camera not focusing? Sorry. There we go. Um, I need to get another one for this drawer. And then also in here I've got hand sanitizer. Um, yeah, nappy change cream. That just came free. And then some cotton wool. So yeah, that is for the little nappy caddy downstairs. Okay, second drawer. I'm just leaning down because my back hurts standing up. <laughs> second drawer is nowhere near as organised. Um, we have got some spare nappies which i need to put away uh all newborn -y bits here so all newborn sleep suits and up to one month um so yeah i've got all those little bits and bobs there and then these are zero to three i think yeah zero to three sleep suits a couple of bibs and some hats and then also some little socks i actually need a lot more of these organizers i've only got what i've got here um, I need to go to Ikea really and get some more organisers because I'd quite like to put the hats in one, the bibs in one and things like that. Uh, I've also got the white noise machine in here. He was actually selling this on Facebook. Um, one of my friends, obviously it hasn't been used. So yeah, just a swaddle. Thought it might be quite nice. I actually just realised I think it's going to be too cold. I've just looked at the thing here, look. Tog, 20 to 24 degrees, which is obviously not going to be. So I don't know if that'll even get used, to be honest. But she was only selling it for a fiver, so I'll just resell it if I need to. Uh, and then a baby towel there, which I've washed. The bottom drawer is basically a nothing drawer. Oh, dear. It's got caught. Yeah, this drawer is a bit of a junk drawer at the minute. Um, it's got a few spare bags, a few toys. Obviously, these are not for the baby. These are actually for my nieces and nephews when they come over uh, and just a few other little bits and bobs that need organizing and then my lovely friend gave me a big thing of breast pads bless her because she didn't use them for hers so that will be really handy so yeah that's what's in the drawers this one isn't organized um, but the rest are kind of quite organized and oh dear just squashed a plastic mouse sorry okay so in the wardrobe um 
there isn't masses in here at the minute i don't think and like i've got nothing in here because i don't really have anything else and <laughs> um, these are all bigger sleep suits so these are all um this one's actually six to nine i think i got this in the next sale it was like two two pounds or something and um, these are all three to six months so these are all not going to be used for a while and then these are all a mixture basically of like newborn zero to three um i've got like a few pairs of leggings on there this little set which is really sweet from h&m um yeah baby grows i really love this one so sweet this is actually newborn so i think this will be used pretty quickly um yeah cardigans this little sleep suit which i got from h&m with a little bunny ears and a tail which is just really sweet um i think that actually might be three to six actually i think it's in the wrong department i think that's three to six as well so they're all yeah they're all a bit muddled up and <laughs> um, but that's what we've got in the wardrobe okay, so that is it that is the little nursery tour over when i say little i mean little because it's a tiny little nursery i actually really like small nurseries because i think they're just so adorable and tiny um so yeah that is the nursery tour i really hope you enjoyed it i hope you're taking some inspiration from it if you are expecting um i will link everything down below as much as i can some things are like i can't link like the moon from bnm and stuff like that but i can link everything else um and yeah i really hope you enjoyed it and let me know and i'll see you all soon bye